The Beast is here. The following is scheduled for one fall. Making his way to the ring from Minneapolis, Minnesota. Weighing in at 286 pounds. Brock. Emotionless, heartless, and hell-bent on absolute destruction. That, my friends, is the Beast Incarnate, Brock Lesnar. The man who beat The Undertaker at WrestleMania to end the streak. Who manhandled John Cena in the most lopsided title match in history at SummerSlam. How do you stop Brock Lesnar? You can't, Cole. You can only hope to survive. Well, this is an extraordinary sight. Goosebump inducing. The awe-inspiring entrance of The Undertaker. Darkness has completely engulfed this entire building. Admit it, Byron, you're scared. A little bit. We are seeing a legend in the flesh. His opponent from Death Valley, weighing in at 299 pounds, The Undertaker. The magnificence of the Phenom. Truly a mesmerizing scene. Let's go! Let's go! The legendary Phenom creates an atmosphere unlike anything you will see. Talk to anyone who's ever been in the ring opposite The Undertaker, and they will tell you nothing prepares you for this. The stoic walk of the dead man. You know, Undertaker is a time-honored warrior of the ring. No matter what you do, I'm not sure there's anything that prepares you for The Undertaker. So many superstars have stood across the ring from the dead man, paralyzed with fear. Abandon all hope. The dead man has risen. Brock Lesnar is the most decorated combat athlete of all time. The only man to hold the NCAA Heavyweight Championship, the UFC Heavyweight Championship, and the WWE Heavyweight Championship. As JBL would say, that is a pure fighting machine. Well, what you're watching is the gunslinger back in action. That's the dead man. And he doesn't have a damn thing to lose, so Brock Lesnar better be ready. Dave off that attack. Undertaker. 
Let's go for the Dragon Sleeper. This is not a familiar position for the Beast Incarnate. The Beast Man gets to the ropes, forcing the break. A lot of damage done, but the ropes offer a reprieve. Top rope, here we go. And his eyes are piercing through the opposition now. Incoming! Crash landing. Lesnar wards him off. Jaw shattering boot. Short jabs to the rib cage. Those are agonizing. Placed it over into a suplex. He's able to combat out of Brock's grip. Turning the tables there. Complete dead left. This is incredible. Go, wrench. No other way to say it, guys. That looked like it hurt a lot. Ooh, the beast in predator mode. Lesnar's proving impossible for the Undertaker to contain. Ooh, body shot. Turns it around. Knee right to the gut. Just punched him right in the mouth. Relentless. Right in the face. My God. Whenever Brock Lesnar is saving us from having to sit through that. Well, Brock waylays him. Scoop slam sets things up. Undertaker needs to head this assault off at the pass. Lesnar's conditioning serving as the strong foundation for these attacks. The Beast Incarnate in a good spot here. Look at this. Boom, nice. Price of treating your own body like a human crash test dummy. Smart strategy, attack the knee. Ugh, gets put into the barricade. On the outside. Back suplex onto the barricade. Stirring back to his feet, but he might not know where he is. He's taking a moment to feel the crowd, but he better focus on the opposition. He's doing a whole lot of gesturing, and it could cost him. Stop. And this one is over. Here is your yes. 
Yes, he didn't come here to watch him boast and taunt. Brock Lesnar continues to cement his legacy as one of the greatest performers in WWE history. The dead man is deceased, and I am speechless.